Hello, welcome back to Cascade Outdoors, where we are bringing you another quail season opener video. It feels like forever, feels like I've been waiting forever to get back out and hunt these quail. You know, I've got a dog now. Everybody was always in the comments, oh, you need a dog, you need a dog. Why don't you have a dog? Well, guess what? I've got a dog and we are out here with the dog getting ready to kick off quail season opener. We've been working on it all year. We hunted doves. I was like, oh man, once dove season's over, it's only gonna feel like two weeks. It felt like five years. We are out here and we are ready to get in and get on those birds. So we'll see you out there. Where's the birds? Because I keep hearing them. Everywhere we go, I keep hearing them calling. And it seems like they keep calling right next to us. And then they move. Wait. Right here, right here. Right here, right here, right here. Drop them, drop them, drop them. Yeah, ranger, hunt them up. Find it. I dusted one right there. Nice! I know. Ranger, get bird, find it. I'm gonna go help ranger get that one. Well, 2022 season opener, off to an amazing start. We're not even 30 minutes into our hunt and Brandon and I both got our first males of the 2022 season. Ranger here is just helping out. Yeah, he's get, get some scent. Yeah, good boy. Good boy, we're getting Ranger on him and it is just a killer day. First quail, 2022 season, my first male. Beautiful fucking bird. This guy helped me get him. This guy's killing it. So this right here is gonna be the first example I get out of Ranger for Basically his first, you know, he's getting real birdie. You can clearly see that he's sticking his head in the bush He's really interested in what's in there He's had rattlesnake aversion training for anybody who wants to say like oh, it's not safe for him to stick his face in there If you don't know what's in there um, I can clearly tell he's he's you know Finally figuring out what the birds smell like and he's finally finding some interest in it And so this is where things start to get interesting Find those birds boy Hey, let me know when you're ready. I'll go up, cause I can hear him right here. Huh? Yeah, I'm just gonna go up on this. Find them birds. Nice. Ranger, find that dead bird. Dead bird, find it. Whoa, dude, that was really good and really bad because he stopped, he pointed, and I didn't, I was like, huh? And then all of a sudden I felt them. All right, mine's like what, over here? You saw yours? Oh, get that one. Oh yeah. You just dusted one on the ground. Hands up, hands up. 
So I'm hoping everybody sees this bird that flies up and I'm imagining that was Brandon's first bird because I found my- Ranger, find that dead bird. Hey, dead bird. There's one right there. One just went, one didn't go all the way. So, oh, as you can see, I have my hat off, I have my vest off. It's, it's been a day. We got over to this spot, which you'll have seen in that last sequence. I shot, I shot this one. I believe Brandon knocked two down and we couldn't find it for the longest time. I thought it was way closer. I ended up downloading the GoPro footage on my phone, watching it 10 times. And then sure enough, I'm like, all right, it's gotta be over here. And I'm looking around and there's Ranger's head in the bush. We just had him on the wrong trail. I was thinking, man, he really can't sniff him out, but he knew what he was doing. He just, we just didn't have him on the right track and we got him on the right track and he found us another bird. So second male so far. And uh, we're gonna get back into to looking for them. We knocked a bunch down and they're just not easy to find right now. So we'll catch you. Get that bird, get that bird. So in the last sequences, when you were looking at Brandon's cam, this was the second shot that he took. And you saw that bird fly up in the bush and you saw him shoot at another bird. This was the other bird, it had flown over the hill. And when we went over the hill, sure enough, Ranger got right onto it and was chasing around. Um, even after we tried picking it up, it just kept, it kept going. It kept going and running around. Yeah. All right, I guess I'll leave you on the ridge and I'll go down like this. So coming into this next sequence, you'll see right here, this is Ranger's first real wild bird point. He just locks up. And of course, I second guessed myself and thought, oh my God, is my GoPro recording this? And Boom, there it goes, gone. Yeah, they're right here, right here. Yeah, right there, right there. Wait, wait, wait. But there's more right here. Yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go right here. Right here, ready, ready? I'm gonna get this one. Get. Oh, my bad, Brandon. I'm an idiot. Listen. All right, get them, get them, they're still. Brandon, they're flying right in front of you. Where'd it go? Huh? Oh, I see it right here. Right there to your left. So by this point in the hunt, we'd gone all the way up this canyon, we are making our way back when Ranger decided to lock up. But previous to this, he was pointing a lot of Tweety birds and kind of telling us like, oh, hey, look, I see a bird, and we didn't believe him. And sure enough, he pointed this bush and three Tweety birds flew up. And then he stayed locked up when they flew away and we had realized, oh man, he might be serious. And without enough time to turn the GoPro on, they flushed and I was able to knock one down, which was a really good feeling. Let me see that bird. Okay, okay, let me see that bird. Good dog, good dog. On the board with another male. Somebody hear something? Yeah! a boy! Have him fetch. Tell him, fetch him up. Just bring him back to your side and then just fetch. Cause that's what I was doing with him that was kind of working. That dog. Ranger bear. Oh, right here, Brandon. Get him. Fetch him up. Fetch him up. I don't know if he's got a live one or a dead one. Perfect, 
Ranger bear. Fetch him up. Good boy. Good boy. All right, thanks for watching. We just finished up our day here. Um, as you can see, the sun's finally coming out. It was probably the coldest day of the month, cloudy all day. Really nice, really perfect weather, especially for having the dog out. He's still young and getting after it. We had an amazing first day back hunting quail. Um, it was tough, you know, we didn't get all the footage we wanted, but we did get a lot of good stuff. We missed a lot of shots, you know. Birds were just coming up out of nowhere. The dog was pointing and was getting excited. Um, but we had a really good day and that's what matters most and make sure you guys stick around This may turn into a two-part series. We might get back out here tomorrow make a second video out of it Keep you guys in tune keep you guys up to date on what's going on in Southern California when it comes to hunting quail um, Make sure you guys like comment subscribe and stick around to the channel check out my social media at Cades got angles on Instagram um, You can check me out on Facebook. You can go through my Instagram probably to find my Facebook and uh, hope you guys enjoy this. Have a good one